So Android 14 just came out in a developer beta kind of situation, and I wanted to kind of break down exactly what the differences are between Android 14 and One UI 5 for the time being. Now the one thing I will definitely tell you is, is that they are both very different. Android you know, 14 is the latest beta. It's not going to be coming out anytime soon, but One UI 5 is officially out and it's based off Android 13. So realistically speaking, anything you can do on Android 13, you can do on you know One UI 5. So definitely keep that in mind. Now, the very first thing that I think Android 14, from what a lot of people have rumored, basically they're stating it's going to happen, is carrier bloatware detection. So with One UI 5, there is a bunch of bloatware built in, but Android 14, one of the features is probably the ability of removing bloatware on our phone. So that is going to be something that's going to be very, very interesting. If we do actually have the ability of removing bloatware on our phone, once One UI 5 or One UI 6 comes out on Android 14, that is going to be a very cool thing that we're going to be able to do is just to remove you know the bloatware on our device potentially so i think that in and of itself is going to be really cool but one ui5 one thing to keep in mind here is that it is a skinned version of android so you are still getting you know even if you can remove bloatware you're still getting like samsung type of applications and you're still getting a samsung type of look on your phone which i'm not opposed to i think it looks fine but it's always been something to kind of keep in mind in the back of your head on top of that what i will also add is that with something like the galaxy s22 you know on one ui5 you have a lot more features built in on a phone like that than like a google pixel 7 on android 14 still so that's always been something to kind of keep in mind in the back of your head that you are getting a more capable machine in my opinion at least from like a feature standpoint on one ui5 so some of these things include one of my favorite things is customizing the lock screen now android 14 is still very new so we still have the ability of you know improving this in the future but that is something that i'm actually really looking forward to on the google side with pixels with stock android being able to just customize that lock screen looks so beautiful and we don't really have that capability we have like a very very so we can change like the text color or something like that we can't change it like how we can on ios 16 and one ui5 so i'm really hoping google ends up doing something like this here because that would make a lot of people want to upgrade. On top of that, another cool thing with Android 14 is that we do have the ability of doing some sort of app cloning. So what this means is we basically are able to go ahead and essentially kind of clone an application if we want different profiles on an app. Well, we can have more than one instance of an application running at the same time. So that's something that's actually really cool. And again, that's another thing I'm actually looking really forward to because that's another cool thing that they just kind of threw in here. So that in and of itself is really cool. Still to this day though, with Android 14 compared to One UI or Android versus One UI, you're getting way sooner updates on one on Android 14 or Android in general than on One UI. You have to wait a long time, most of the time, for One UI updates. And even when the update's out, it still takes a long time from my perspective. But with Android 14, it's still coming out in a beta. So you have to keep that in mind. It's still a very slow type of release, and it's not going to be officially out until like September or August. So we still have many, many months of this specific update coming out, getting more features, so many different things like that. We're getting like new features founded every single day, which is actually really cool. On the One UI 5 side, I feel like things are pretty much kind of done. I mean, we kind of already know everything within it. And I would say it was a decent update coming from One UI 4. One UI 3 was a pretty big update. One UI 4 was an okay update. But One UI 5, I think, is looking to be a pretty massive update when it comes down. But Android 14 is looking to be, I think from what they're doing, is looking to be a pretty good update. And once One UI 5 comes out or One UI 6 comes out, that's going to be a pretty big thing in my opinion. So in terms of that, that kind of covers it up there. If you have any other thoughts or questions, then let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would be so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, well done.